Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for your Manitoba And the Moose have the puck off the draw. Melchiori looking up ice. Flips it high in the air. Bounces in the Rockford zone. Picking it up and in. Robinson shoots. He scores! Yeah, buddy! The Moose have the opening goal of the game and the series. Comp will play it off. Di Domenico again circling. Di Domenico in. Di Domenico with room. Can't get the shot away. Now he does and it's blocked. Desperation work there by the Moose. It's five on five, but Rockford looking power play-esque. Bounced one to the line, Clem Denning to Franzen. Franzen at the left circle, cross ice on the tape, firing Di Domenico, it's in behind Comrie, and then swept out of the crease. Somehow it stays out. Back to Franzen, shoots. That one hits Toikowicz, Comrie's on top of it, and they're gonna dodge those threats and maintain the one to nothing lead. <laughs> In university play in the States, Minnesota State Mankato and North Dakota as H shall get some room. He's in to the backhand, scores. Slick finish there from Victor H shall. And we've got ourselves a 1 1 tie as the left hand shot came down the right side and looked ever so cool putting it away. Glendening stationary. The Moose are happy with that, but now he's getting more mobile and he gets it off to Di Domenico. Backside scores. Deflected in in front by Sakura, who got net side on Schilling and was able to put it into the net. Rockford makes the Moose pay for the penalty problems. Top defenseman in the American Hockey League this season skating with the puck and suddenly down on the ice, and they score. Hayden takes advantage of a pass in front, drives it by Comrie, and it goes from a non-call to a two-goal Rockford lead. <laughs> Patan for unsportsmanlike conduct, the empty net, and Rockford puts this one away. They battle along the end board. Cease finds the puck, goes to the line for Kostlik. He snaps one, scores! And that one looked like it went off Spedberg in front, and dipped went between the pads of Delia, and the Moose have a second to make it 4-2. Eric Comrie's wondering if he's wanted at the bench 